Welcome to Miniorange. Miniorange provides single sign-on solutions for Confluence Marketplace and as we know that is the best OAuth and OpenID SSO solution available in the market. So, in this video, we are going to set up Confluence single sign-on with AWS Cognito, using OpenID protocol. Let's get started with the setup. Go to the Confluence dashboard and click on the setting icon on the top right corner and select manage apps option go to find new apps you can search here for add-ons in atlassian marketplace go to the search tab and type oauth sso and press enter to download the plugin click on free trial click on accept and install to agree with many orange policy and terms of use after successful installation use the license key to activate the plugin and after activation of the license key, click on Miniorange OAuth Client. Now you are on Configure OAuth tab. We will be covering AWS Cognito setup here. You can also go through this setup on this guide. Here you will get step-by-step -step instruction. So, firstly we are configuring AWS Cognito as OpenID provider. Sign into AWS Amazon. Now go to the search bar at the top, and enter Cognito. Select Cognito from drop-down. Go to Manage User Pools. You can create a new pool, by clicking on the Create a New Pool button on the top right corner. Here we will select the already created pool. Navigate to App Client Settings. Check the Cognito User Pool checkbox. You will find the callback URL, in the plugin, which is used to tell the OAuth provider where to send the token after authentication. Copy it, and paste it in the given field. Scroll down, and select Authorization Code Grant as Allowed OAuth Flows, and under Allowed OAuth Scopes, select Open ID, to authenticate with AWS Cognito. Click on Save Changes. You can create your domain, by navigating to the Domain Name tab. And you can create the Users and Groups, by navigating to the Users and Groups tab. Now, go to the App Clients from the left panel. And you will find the App Client ID here. Click on Show Details button, to get the App Client secret. Now let's set up Confluence's OAuth Client. Go to Configure OAuth tab. As earlier we have selected AWS Cognito as an application. Copy the App Client ID from the application, and paste it in the Client ID in the plugin. Copy the App Client secret from the application, and paste it in the Client secret in the plugin. Enter the scope as Open ID. In the Domain Name field, enter the AWS Cognito Domain Name. Logout Endpoint is optional. Click on Save. Now you can see OAuth Settings updated message. Scroll down and click on Test Configuration. And you can see successful test configuration here. Along with the name. Cognito Username, and Email ID. After successful test connection, you will get the CSSO button on the Confluence Login page now. Click on Use OAuth Login button and you will be redirected to AWS Cognito Login page for OAuth authentication. Now enter your AWS Cognito credentials and click on Sign In button. You will be successfully logged into your Confluence dashboard using AWS Cognito credentials. Go to the User Profile to check the user data. And you can see the user's email ID here. Miniorange provides best single sign-on solutions. Thanks for watching.